Hi everyone, I'm Jesse Crawl. Welcome to Tommy Media's The Locker Room. Ranked number one in its region, St. Thomas will host St. Norbert in the first round of the NCAA playoff Saturday. The Green Knights are 8-2 this season and have a five-game winning streak. The Tommies are 7-3 in playoff games under coach Glenn Caruso. Last year they made it to the semifinals before losing to Wisconsin Whitewater. I'm joined today by defensive coordinator Wally Kaczynski and defensive end Io Idowu. Thanks for joining us, guys. Thanks for having us. Thanks for having Coach, us. Coach, your defense is ranked 13th in the nation, allowing only 269 yards per game. What makes them so dominant? Well, I think that what makes them a very good unit is the fact that they care very, very deeply about each other. They have focused on um, the idea of the we and not the me. And from seniors to Iowa Doe, all the way down to freshmen, they have bought into uh, that this is a unit and we're all in this together and that uh, not one person is going to highlight who we are. Io, you've made a huge impact on the defense with 32 and a half tackles and five sacks. What is the best part of your game? Uh, the best part of them. My game or our game as a team is that uh, we play together. And I think one of the reasons I've been able to come free so many times this year is because everybody's doing their job. And you know, when everyone's in their gap, there's going to be one gap that's free. And I guess I've just been lucky to be able to come free so many times this year. Coach, you faced St. Norbert in the 2011 home opener and won 20 to 7, despite being down 7 to nothing in the first quarter. What do you think St. Norbert will bring to the field this time around? Well, I think the good thing about football is that every year is a new season, and every season is a, a new story. And you put the story back on the bookshelf every single year, and they have a new team. Uh, their coach has been here for a lot of years. Uh, their coach, they've been in the playoffs now, I think I read 10 times, uh, nine in the last 14 times they've been in the playoffs. So uh, to be honest with you, we respect uh, St. Norbert's, but this game isn't really about St. Norbert's. This game is uh, more about us, and we have a great group of guys, and we have a big family of players. Uh, as I mentioned, from the seniors all the way down to the freshmen, the coaches care very, very deeply about each other, and we just want to play one more game, one more week. We want to be able to be together one more uh, game, one more week, one more month, five weeks, just one more week. So, Io, your senior class only has four losses, but still seeks that elusive national championship. What is it about this year's team that will push you over the top? Um, you know, we just build off every year. That's why I think uh, ever since I've been here, back in 2009, there's been something different every single year. And last year's team showed a lot of heart and a lot of just growth from the year before. And I think as a senior class, we decided that we want to take what that last year's class did and build even more and get stronger and even closer as a team. So. And especially nice to be able to go as far as we did last year. We know what to expect. We know what's going on, and we know that uh, what we what we we're gonna, what we're going to need from practice every single day to preparation for a game, and what we're going to have to do to take steps forward. And now it's time for this week's fan question, Coach Junior Kitty Lascarbo wants to know: Looking back at last year's playoff loss against Whitewater, what did you and your defense learn from it, and how will it affect you in this year's playoffs? Uh, that's a good, very good question. Uh, we played an incredible football team, an incredible offense in uh, Wisconsin Whitewater last year. I think that going into this season, we wanted to play with a lot more confidence to be able to have a, a swagger, if you like to use that term. I feel like our defenses have been very, very uh, uh, tight-knit. As I mentioned, our, our guys care so deeply about each other. but. If there's one thing that we can build on throughout the course of the season, even having a lot of new faces every season is a, is a different story. As I mentioned, you have a lot of new players. Um, I'd like to see our guys play with some confidence throughout this stretch run and see how many weeks we can be together. If you have a question, tweet it to at Tommy Media. Be sure to check TommyMedia.com for the latest campus news. Thanks for tuning in. With defensive coordinator Wally Kaczynski and Ioe Dowu, I'm Jesse Crawl. We'll see you next time in the locker room. <laughs>